Salam everyone. Welcome to BioStube, your pharmacy learning partner. I'm Mintznot, and in this video, we'll review 25 of the most recent Ethiopian COC pharmacy exam questions. Let's see how many you can get right. Don't forget to subscribe, like, hit the bell icon and share. Number 1. Which route of administration has 100% bioavailability? A. Oral. B. Intramuscular. C. Intravenous. D. Subcutaneous. Answer. C. Intravenous. Explanation. IV administration bypasses absorption, delivering the drug directly into systemic circulation. Number 2. What is the antidote for paracetamol poisoning? A. Flamazenil. B. Atropine. C. N-acetylcysteine. D. Naloxone. Answer. C. N-acetylcysteine. Explanation. NAC replenishes glutathione to detoxify harmful metabolites of paracetamol. Number 3. Which dosage form is designed for rectal administration? A. Tablet. B. Suppository. C. Capsule. D. Syrup. Answer. B. Suppository. Explanation. Suppositories are solid forms used rectally for local or systemic effect. 4. A drug used to reduce fever is called A. Analgesic B. Antibiotic C. Antipyretic D. Antiemetic Answer. C. Antipyretic Explanation. Antipyretics like paracetamol reduce elevated body temperature. 5. What is the role of the pharmacist in dispensing? A. Diagnose diseases. B. Manufacture drugs. C. Prescribe medications. D. Ensure correct medication use. Answer. D. Ensure correct medication use. Explanation. Pharmacists ensure proper use of prescribed drugs and counsel patients. 6. Which class of drug is metformin? A. Sulfonylurea. B. Biguanide. C. Thiazolidinidione. D. Insulin analog. Answer. B. Biguanide. Explanation. Metformin is a biguanide that lowers glucose production in the liver. 7. Which vitamin is fat soluble? A. Vitamin B1. B. Vitamin C. C. Vitamin D. D. Vitamin B12. Answer. C. Vitamin D. Explanation. Fat soluble vitamins include A, D, E, and K. 8. What is the mechanism of action of penicillin? A. Protein synthesis inhibitor. B. DNA synthesis inhibitor. C. Cell wall synthesis inhibitor. D. Antimetabolite. Answer. C. Cell wall synthesis inhibitor. Explanation. Penicillin inhibits bacterial cell wall synthesis, leading to cell death. 9. Which medication is used in asthma? A. Omeprazole. B. Salbutamol. C. Metformin. D. Atorvastatin. Answer. B. Salbutamol. Explanation. Salbutamol is a beta-2 agonist that relaxes bronchial smooth muscles. 10. What is the normal storage condition for most tablets? A. 2 to 8 degrees Celsius. B. 15 to 25 degrees Celsius. C. 30 to 40 degrees Celsius. D. 40 to 60 degrees Celsius. Answer. B. 15 to 25 degrees Celsius. Explanation. Room temperature 15 to 25 degrees Celsius is standard for storing tablets unless otherwise stated. 11. What is the primary use of furosemide? A. Antidiabetic. B. Antihypertensive. C. Diuretic. D. Antidepressant. Answer. C. Diuretic. Explanation. 
Furosemide is a loop diuretic used to treat edema and hypertension. 12. What is the antidote for opioid overdose? A. Atropine. B. N-acetylcysteine. C. Naloxone. D. Flamazonil. Answer. C. Naloxone. Explanation. Naloxone rapidly reverses opioid effects by blocking opioid receptors. 13. Which of the following is a proton pump inhibitor? A. Ranitidine. B. Omeprazole. C. Metoclopramide. D. Famotidine. Answer. B. Omeprazole. Explanation. Omeprazole inhibits gastric acid secretion by blocking proton pumps. 14. Which drug can cause hypoglycemia? A. Glybenclamide. B. Acarbose. C. Metformin. D. Citagliptin. Answer. A. Glybenclamide. Explanation. Glybenclamide stimulates insulin release, which can lead to hypoglycemia. 15. What is the main adverse effect of aminoglycosides? A. Hepatotoxicity. B. Nephrotoxicity. C. Constipation. D. Headache. Answer. B. Nephrotoxicity. Explanation. Aminoglycosides like gentamicin are known for kidney toxicity. 16. The term, OTC, stands for A. Over the clinic. B. Over the counter. C. Out the chemist. D. Out to consult. Answer. B. Over the counter. Explanation. OTC drugs are sold without a prescription. 17. What is the main use of ORS oral rehydration salt? A. Fever. B. Vomiting. C. Dehydration. D. Cough. Answer. C. Dehydration. Explanation. ORS replaces fluids and electrolytes lost during diarrhea. 18. Which of the following is a controlled drug? A. Amoxicillin. B. Diazepam. C. Paracetamol. D. Ranitidine. Answer. B. Diazepam. Explanation. Diazepam is a benzodiazepine with abuse potential and is controlled. 19. What does, stat, mean on a prescription? A. Every 6 hours. B. Once daily. C. Immediately. D. Before food. Answer. C. Immediately. Explanation. Stat, instructs the medication to be given immediately. 20. What is the drug of choice for anaphylactic shock? A. Hydrocortisone. B. Diphenhydramine. C. Epinephrine. D. Salbutamol. Answer. C. Epinephrine. Explanation. Epinephrine is the first-line treatment for anaphylaxis. 21. Which dosage form is best for children with difficulty swallowing? A. Capsule. B. Tablet. C. Oral suspension. D. Suppository. Answer. C. Oral suspension. Explanation. Suspensions are liquid forms that are easier for children to swallow and allow dose flexibility. 22. Which class of drugs does atorvastatin belong to? A. Beta blockers. B. Satins. C. ACE inhibitors. D. Diuretics. Answer. B. Satins. Explanation. Atorvastatin is a statin used to lower cholesterol levels and reduce cardiovascular risk. 23. What does the abbreviation, B, I, D, mean in prescriptions? A. Every hour. B. Twice a day. C. Three times a day. D. Four times a day. Answer. B. Twice a day. Explanation. B. I. D. Stands for bis and die, which means twice daily. 24. Which of the following drugs is used as an antiemetic? A. Loperamide. B. 
metoclopramide, C, omeprazole, D, ranitidine. Answer, B, metoclopramide. Explanation, metoclopramide prevents nausea and vomiting by blocking dopamine receptors. 25. What is the therapeutic use of isoniazid? A. Hypertension. B. Diabetes. C. Tuberculosis. D. Asthma. Answer. C. Tuberculosis. Explanation. Isoniazid is a first-line anti-TB drug used in both treatment and prevention. Great job going through these 25 COC pharmacy questions with me. I hope this helped you review and learn something new today. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to Biostube, and click the bell icon so you won't miss the next set of questions. I'm Mintznot, keep learning, keep growing, and I'll see you in the next video. Until then, stay smart and stay safe.